Hey guys, it's Buddy Simon 2 here, and welcome back to episode 3 on the SMP server on Skycade. As you can see in the background, I have done quite a bit of progress here. You can see that I've built a half of the lovely shop. I'm just experimenting what I like better. And I think I might just add like a ring of white going around the outside just to add a little bit of characteristics. I've started work on putting through here, so this is how the player warps, warps are going to work. So we're going to have the shops here, and then we're going to have the player builds around in here. And then we're going to have some gardens going here, but my main thing today is to get the site here finished. We're going to put in a, a little window here, which is going to look at the lovely view and look over to my lovely kelp farm. So that's for what we're going to be doing today. We're going to be working and trying to get this farm nice and finished. And as you can see there, Buddy Seminar 2 YouTube, that there is my new account or an alt account. And I only got that one there because I found a Prezi card in my wallet, which I completely forgot about and that was about to expire in a couple of days. So I just got this account here and had the perfect amount of money to get a new one. And, well, I don't know what else to spend it on. So I thought, why not waste money on a game which is just a waste of time, really. But, yeah, so that's what we're going to do. We're going to go ahead and we're going to start work on this bit here. Placing in all the bits of wood and stuff in the arches. So let's get right into doing that now. Okay guys, to start things off, we are going to... Okay guys, to start things off, we're going to start dyeing some banners uh, for our little sign. So let's click on here, if it wants to let me, come on. Okay, so what we have to do is, we're going for the letter A. So what we have to do is we place in some die going along the top and our banner. And that this should appear in if it doesn't want to lag as much. So I'm going to do that there. Yep, there we go. We have got our piece right here. Our first bit of the banner. And then next off, we need to go either side. Come on, stop lagging. This is not fun. I hate it when it does this. It's just, it's been the connection lag for the server's been quite bad all day. I only want to die one. Oh, come on. Okay, I'm going to go, there we go, got the one. Then I died, and then we go along the bottom. And that this should give us a little stripe there. And then we need to do the next part of the banner, which includes going down on both sides. So we go down on one side here. And as soon as it loads, because the, it is just horrible, my connection today, I have a feeling someone in my household might be watching Netflix because that causes my internet to lag out. That's also a reason why I don't stream at all because I, it just doesn't work. So there we go, we've got one side, and then we need to go and do the other side. Oh, come on. And there we go, we have now got a A right there so next off we need to go ahead and we need to give ourselves well, apparently I'm, I'm, I'm definitely not watching a video on my phone right now but we need to go go around and bow meal to give it a nicer looking a and then next off i'm going to go ahead and i'm going to finish off all the other letters since this is so painful and how slow it is so I'll see you guys very shortly. Here we go, from we now have P warp sorted. So um, I just realised that's going to cover over that one there, but it's P W A R and P. What did this one here say again? 
uh, help ward. We can we can just get rid of that there. So this here says P warp, and this is where our P warps will be. So we should be able to stand out. So if anyone walks past, about to see like, let's see some letters, and we're about to see P warp, and then people are about to go, oh yep, we can player shops and these type of shops here. So that is pretty good. So now let's get back into the building. Then you might have just been able to see me up there, my little account there that should be able to help do some, just some, yeah. Since we don't have any re replay mods yet, that's going to be my little recording thing, which is going to be pretty cool because I'm about to use it there on my single player world as well. I'll just open it to land, chuck this little fella in, and then we can start recording me building this here and also start work on the island, which should be pretty good because I'm going to have my single player survival coming out in the next, let's say, two, three weeks at the most. And coming out next Wednesday, we should have an hour-long episode of Skyrim, if anyone is interested in watching that stuff. But yeah, let's split into this little time-lapse sort of thing, where I'm going to add some lovely, calming music over top. Let's get right into it. Okay, everyone, let's get right in to this lovely time-lapse, and hope everyone enjoys what I am about to do, I just need to double check that everything is all aligned and it apparently appears that somehow I have mismeasured this to start off with anyway. So let's just quickly go ahead and fix this here up and we are meant to have another chest going here So I see we've only got six there so far. So I'm going to quickly go over here and craft ourselves a another bench. There we go, I mean chest. Another chest there. So let's go in right now and get this wall nice and completed. And I'll speed this up for you guys so it's not as boring. And let's start that lovely music. And I'm not sure what it's going to be yet, but we'll add that in shortly. Hope you all enjoy. See you at the end of this lovely time lapse. There we go everyone, that now concludes our little time lapse there. Hope you all enjoyed. And now we have got all our walls almost completed. Let's just put that one there. Just to fix that there up. But everything here should be all fine. So this is what the place is starting to look like. It's starting to look pretty magnificent. If I may say so myself, if that is correct. Now we need to pretty much we need to get we need to get light in here. So I was thinking if we remove underneath the stairs, is that gonna emit enough light? Not not, not really. Does it does it make any difference if it's underneath of a chest? Here we go. Okay, we're gonna be putting the lights underneath the chest then. Because we need to light up this space here because it's very dark in here. So I'm going to go ahead and light this up and I'll be back with you guys shortly. There we go people, just lighting up underneath those chests make a, makes a massive difference. How light the build is, I'm not sure if I'm going to hang any chandelier sort of things up there. I'm not exactly sure but we have still got the front there to do which I think I might do like a little glass dome. And then we've got the back here which I'm probably just going to follow this pattern design going around. So next off we need to start work on the P-warp section. 
So what I thought I would do is I was pretty much going to carry this going around. So just essentially get rid of all of this junk here. And then just dig out here and put these bits of mossy cobblestone going around. Now that we've got the mossy cobblestone going around, I thought we would have like a quartz area. So it's a little bit spotted. So we have quartz and then we have diorite. It's diorite, isn't it? So we have just a little sort of pattern going around the entire room. These are actually getting in very annoying. So it's just that we have a little like a little design sort of thing. I suppose you could call it and I thought I heard some chaos going on there obviously not so this is where we're going to be set, putting in our signs in here which I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to complete both rooms like this here and I'll be back with you guys shortly okay everyone both rooms are now completed as you can see here I expanded this one here because this is going to be the warp shop wall and it's going to be P warp shop wall and it's going to be pretty compact i think i might have to do some more expanding down below there we also have the player build wall built in here and i've also started work on completing the end part of the shop or cathedral sort of looking thing now it, it, it's it's a mess it's quite complicated to try and get this done so that's why i decided to do this bit off the camera and it's taken me quite a while because it's been quite a bit of block lag like like you place a block down, like try and block, break it, we break a block and then it somehow works perfectly fine when I'm recording. But anyway, I'm going ahead and I'm going to finish off doing this last half because it's just a pain going back and forth and scaffolding everywhere to check if everything is okay. And then I'm going to go ahead and I have to try and figure out what I'm going to do here. I think I could do the same, if this end here looks okay, I'll probably do the same down here, but then I'll make it look like a giant bun. If not, I'll probably put it like, I'll like have a, like a bit, bit more glass in here would be nice compared to just this one patch here. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and do that, and I'll see you guys once it is done. Okay everyone, this is what it is now looking like. I think it looks pretty good myself. So I think I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to duplicate what I have got down this end, down this end, to make it look like a giant bun. And that means this building will be pretty much complete. Afterwards, we will go through and add in all the items to the chest, and I'll go through and add in all the P warp signs because it's going to take quite a long time to do that. And then I'll also put in, I need to put in like a little donation center as well. And that is going to be this build done for now. And it will also be probably my last video for quite some time until I think of another project to do because I'll be doing quite a bit of grinding and turtles having a bit of fun in that little tiny lake down there. Okay, let's get right back. He's just high, but he's not online. Okay. Anyway, or we could be in Vanish if the developers and finish. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and do that, and I'll see you guys very shortly. Okay, everyone, the store is almost completed. Now, all we have to do is go ahead and place in all of our bits and bobs from our last store. So, for gravel, we go chest, shop, create, and we want to sell the gravel for 64 as a stack. For $120 and I will buy it for $25 of fuel and we put normal at the end. We right click the chest and there we go. We've got gravel for sale. And then we do the same for sand. Except I am selling sand for a, a different price. You own you get 32 for $90. And I'll probably change these prices because they're probably a bit too expensive. Um, that she should, I probably should uh, go chest shop, remove, are you going to load, get, click that one there, go number one, and I'll keep, just put this one here as 90 as well, 32 for 90, because it's a bit, but similar to get, and then I'm going to go ahead and I've got to place in all these other bits and pieces, that I got along here. I've got my list. I'm going to do a row of ores as well. 
a bit of rear items through here and also in the p-warp is now we've now got this all nice and done so i'm going to pan back around through here very shortly once i've completed it all and to show you guys the finished product and that will be all for today's video because i'll be running out of time or oh, i'm sick of sitting on playing the game so yeah my eyes getting a bit sore so i need to have a bit of a break so i'll see you guys once it's all okay everyone the store is now completed you can see i've got all the items going along here selling some iron hopefully this doesn't sell out too quick but iron is really expensive on the server and hard to come by if it sells i'll probably have to put up the price We've got everything going along here. We come down here, we've got packed ice, saddles, a whole lot of chicken eggs. We're going to have wooden that's come here in the future. Some rare items will be going up here. And if we turn around, this place is looking amazing. So if you can see there, it is looking beautiful. And if we come around here, you see the lovely pea warp. You come around in here and you can see profit shops, normal shops, and also mending books. There we go. And if you pop around here, you can see that we've got a couple warps placed down here. So I hope everyone enjoyed watching this video today. If you did, well, come check out my store if you even watch these videos. Because I don't think there's no one watching them at all. Because I'm perfect at making them, so I don't need any views. Hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in episode 4. Not sure what I'm going to do, but that will be coming out in a, quite a while's time. I'll be just working away, grinding away, and working on the shop. So I'll see you guys next time, and let's cue that Outro. Yeah,